Good evening. I'm Greg Pickett, Associate Dean for Clemson University's College of Business and Behavioral Science, Greenville. Being a part of the inaugural Who's Who Awards this year is meaningful to us as a sponsor because Clemson is developing a true relationship with Greenville and the upstate community. We've established satellite locations all around the city, the latest of which you are standing in right now, Greenville One, home of all the professional business graduate programs, including the Clemson MBA. Sponsoring this event is important because we like to help recognize key leaders in this community, and who's who is an ideal way for us to do that. I am especially pleased that our sponsorship opportunity has allowed us to introduce Rick Davis of Elliott Davis LLC. I have known Rick several years, and I'm amazed at his commitment to Greenville and his undying dedication to support economic development in this area. Elliott Davis is a fixture in downtown Greenville, and Rick goes out of his way to create a culture that fosters community involvement and personally supports so many local events and organizations. There are few others I know of who have had as much positive influence in the community as Rick, and this quality makes him who's who worthy. I think the, the one thing that really drives me is looking for ways to be better, whatever that might be. Anything that we are going to spend time doing, there's always a chance that we can improve and we need to look for the ways that we can be better every day. The most rewarding part of work as I see it today is, is helping other people reach their full potential, to find a way to, to really develop, to understand what they could be and how they can contribute and to help them in achieving their own goals. I believe that in the world of accomplishments that, that having uh, uh, been able to have uh, children who have uh, been able to be successful and move in the right direction and, and be on the path toward what they want to accomplish in life would, would definitely be at the top of that list. My favorite word would be think. Think uh, leads you down a lot of paths and, and if we all stop and think then we can accomplish so many things that if we don't stop to think won't happen. If I could be anything that, that I could have been, I would, I would have been a farmer. I think uh, I, had, I grew up in an agricultural community and I had a great deal of respect for farmers and, and appreciate what they did and it was something that I always sort of felt close to and never really came close to being that. But when I look back at life and say, wow, uh, would have been cool to be a farmer, would have been great to be in that profession and to do all the things that I've learned over the years and, and already knew that farmers did, I, I, think, I think I would have liked to have been a farmer. I would hope that other people would, would understand and see me as someone that, that really did care about other people, that wanted the best for other people, that was probably a bit serious and not necessarily always uh, seen as easy to approach, but, but for the people that really get to know me, understand that deep down inside that uh, I am about uh, helping everybody else be better and giving them the opportunity to be better in whatever that means in their world.